Hello and welcome back to the dungeon that Fabric forgot. Without further ado, let's press on. We actually made some progress on the Demon Lord the last time. Okay, attack the Mer thing. Zoom down the corridor. Um, the last time we managed to freeze the Demon Lord, but then when we tried to follow up on that freeze and finish freezing the whole of his body, because that seemed to be what the text was implying, he scratched us across the face and we exploded or something. I don't know. Probably our clothes flew off, because that seems to be what happens when you die in Avalice Dungeon. Yes, press the blue eyes. Fine. So, I'm going to use the strategy that I was tempted to try the last time. Um, so, start off by freezing him, as before. And now that he's part immobilised, use that upgraded Hellfire spell. Is this going to work? Yes! That's it! What an anticlimactic victory! Fire spurts out of his eye, his forehead, all over his body. I'm pretty sure raining fire on someone doesn't make fire come out of their face. Is that is that a known phenomenon? Well, anyway. You may have stopped me, but you'll never stop the other demons. Which is obviously setting us up for the sequel or sequels to Avalice Dungeon. I know there's at least one. So, what an impressive victory. What a roller coaster ride it was. Did we get credits or anything? The Demon Lord has been destroyed. Congratulations, Dungeon 1 has been completed. Could you have at least come up with a more... I don't know, a, a, a name that makes more effort than Dungeon 1. I mean, how often have you read any kind of good adventure, or even bad adventure, even those crappy Dungeons & Dragons spin-off novels? Has anyone ever resorted to going, now we must pass Town 5 in order to explore Dungeon 1? Ugh. I just want to punch Team Shuriken. I'm sorry, then... They seem like nice enough people, but they can't make games for shit. They probably could if they tried, but they don't. So, get away from me, Team Shuriken. Start again and try other paths to fight new enemies. Why would I do that? God, talk about optimism. Get ready for the next adventure, coming soon. And that's it for Avalice Dungeon. At least Avalice Dungeon 1. That wraps up the first part of the Team Shuriken project. As I said before, in the first video in this series, I'm planning to let's play Team Shuriken's games in chronological order. I can't remember what the next one is, but um, when I find out, you'll find out too. Thanks for suffering through Avalice Dungeon with me, and I will see you the next time.